he went back to the teachings of their fathers. He says, do not walk in the statutes of your fathers. Or keep their rules. Listen to me. When you notice that a person is calling himself a father and his walk is not genuine, the Lord has given you grace to abscon it. And there is nothing they can do and say that, oh, you know I cast you, cast who? You are not walking correct. This is what you call vain submission. A lot of us, you are submitting to errors, obvious errors. He says that do not walk. Number one is walk. Do you remember there's a scripture that connects with it? It says, walk ye, what ye? Of your calling. It means your calling should define your walk. No man should take you. No type of submission should take you away from God because of loyalty. Walk ye, what ye of your calling. Let your calling be the guiding factor to your walking. Define your walking based on your calling. Not submission. He says, number two, do not walk in their statutes and do not keep their rules. A lot of rules. You see that these rules have nothing to do with the kingdom of God. But you see, you know here, this is how we do it. This is how our fathers did it. What, what, what are you saying? If really the fathers did it, Jesus would not have warned them. Again, it's the same fathers. And I can tell you they are genuine men that have decided to walk with the Lord. And I can tell you they are men that are not walking with the Lord. Those people that are not walking with the Lord, walk away from any man that refuses to walk with the Lord. Walk away from that man. They will land you in a ditch. He says, how can one blind man lead another? When you notice a man is blind. When you notice a man begins to teach a funny doctrine. He begins to tell you how when you sin, you won't die. Hmm? Listen. Can a camera come closer to me? Which camera should I use? Zoom in, zoom in. Put, put my face very well. My name is John C.W. Listen to me. Is it, is it zoomed? Eh? Can you see me? Listen. <laughs> when you sin, eh? you will die. You, hey. hey! You are dead. The Bible says that the wages of sin is death. But the gift of God is eternal if any man teaches, the Bible says, even if the angels and they teach anything separate apart from this, you will die. If you continue in your sin, you will drown in it. He says, the gift of God is eternal life. Remember that. 